What is up guys, it is MajorBro35 with a short little tutorial video and this is going to be how to port forward with your Apple Airport uh, router. Now um, this works with any airport uh, router that they have come out with so far and so uh, I'm going to show you guys how to do that and uh, you're going to want to go to uh, Airport Utility application and this is the same for both Macs and uh, PCs. So you're going to click on your airport uh, device. And it, it can be either a airport in enterprise, I think what's it called, or, and then a express. So uh, I have both, and it works with both of them. I just have this one plugged in right now. And so you're going to go to manual setup. Wait for it to read it. And then you're going to go to uh, advanced. And now you want to go to the tab port mapping. Let's see right there I have Minecraft already under it. And uh, I'm just going to, let's edit that. And so you're going to actually want to do plus right here. And you click that. And it will bring up this. And it will have like d uh, no port so far. So you do 25565, 25565 on all of the uh, public and private ports. And then the private IP address, you're going to want to use your uh, IP4 address, which uh, is easy to find. It's under the information of the airport. And then you do can't continue, and then you can change the description to Minecraft or whatever. I use Minecraft because it is 25565 is the uh, um, port for Minecraft servers because I run my uh, own Minecraft server. So you do done, and then you're going to do update, and then it's going to restart, and it's just going to be, it's just going to update all the changes that you made, and uh, that should work. It's going to restart the uh, thing, and yeah, uh, usually the main reason for port forwarding is just because uh, most people want to run their own Minecraft server, and uh, for it to be public, like no Hamachi or anything, you need a uh, you need to have it port forwarded, and it's it's a a lot different on other uh, other um, routers. But for this one, uh, for the airport ones, it's a lot different. For uh, and it's pretty simple. Like you don't have to sign in or anything. You just have the uh, airport utility. Now, if you don't have airport utility, utility um downloaded it should be with the it should be on a disc that came with your um airport device and so you can just pop that in and install it and it has drives for both PC and Mac so right after that it's just going to load it back up and it should be ready to go um i hope you guys enjoyed this video or enjoy this not enjoyed it but I hope it helped you guys out um, with port forwarding, and because it can be a hassle if you want to run a Minecraft server but don't understand how to do it. All right, see you guys next time. Peace.